king size bed. Heck yeah. Very, very nice. Some big fans. Very, very cool. They really want to get you on the sales pitches to where you check in and then to get your parking pass, you got to talk to the salespeople. But luckily, the lady just gave us a pass. So she knew we were like yeah. done with it. I was like, I ain't trying to get a sales pitch. But our spot is like right around the corner. So uh, let's go check out our room. I'm noticing that the design of these, hold on, let me go to widescreen. This is exactly the same. Exactly the same as Tuscany Village. Wow. I mean, from the elevators and everything. Tucker Town House. The only difference is they had the water fountains at Tuscany Village. I don't think they all had a water fountain. They just all had there. Yeah, very nice. All right. Where are we going? Where are we going? Where's our, well, maybe the, the elevators were here. So the elevators are in a slightly different spot. Well, I guess the door is. Oh yeah, top floor, baby. That's 605, 604. We might be all the way on the end. This is 11602. All right, Hilton's Grand Vacation, SeaWorld. All right, let's turn on some lights. So here is our room at Hilton's Grand Vacation, SeaWorld. When you first walk in the door, you got a little kitchenette here to your left. Ice bucket, sink, pretty nice coffee machine, coffee accessories. Microwave. Do we have a, oh, we do, look at that. They even give you a wine glass. <laughs> Nothing. Also have a little mini fridge here. So this one's not like the one at Tuscany Village where we had the full fridge, but uh, you know, basically the side my parents stayed on that was slightly smaller. This is a safe, luggage rack, closet, iron, ironing board, cool, cool. And then uh, a mirror to admire ourselves when getting ready to go out to SeaWorld. And then into here, which, how do we, uh, well, that controls the fan. So that controls the fan light. Okay, I'm just gonna hit all the buttons. So this is the room. There we go, that's a thumbnail. It was AC, she figured it out. But yeah, as I was saying, king size bed, looks amazing, looks very comfortable. Love the headboard up here. Got a nice little nightstand here. A little alarm clock and everything, nothing special about that. There is like three USB ports here though. Yeah, three USB ports. This light with an outlet, nice. Anything in the drawer? Nope. Got a very nice AC controller here on the uh, wall. Nice and touch screen. Well, I guess it's not touch screen, but looks very nice. And uh, this is like, I guess our kitchen table and stuff. Dig the golden yellowish seats. Nightstand on this side. Same power outlets, old school phone. Nothing in there. Nice picture. One of my favorites, a nice chair here. And then over here, a nice TV. So same thing. Nope. This has a Blu-ray player. You can uh, get movies downstairs, I believe, for you know people who play Blu-rays. And then this is probably a 42-ish inch TV, I would say, give or take. Nice, uh, fancy remote. I like these lights. They look like they would be candles. 
but they're lights. And we do have a fan there, but the best part is out here because of course I love having a balcony. One of my uh, favorite parts. Oh yes, look at this. Is there a light for out here? No, there's oh, a light right there. Oh, uh, there we go. So we got a little seating area. It sounds like we're close to the uh, AC vents down there, but nice looking view just out over the city, I guess, of Orlando. I don't really know exactly where we're facing, but I love it. And it's, uh, and it's private. Nobody can really see us out here. Like, I mean, you could, but you'd have to really be looking. So, well, there we go. That's a room tour. You didn't do the bathroom. Oh, I didn't. Wow, I'm losing my touch on these. I haven't did one in so long because we haven't stayed anywhere. <laughs> the restroom. So, the restroom. This one, we do have a nice curved shower curtain. That should be a standard in every uh, shower in the world. Nice little soaker tub. I love when they do this. Shampoo, conditioner, shower gel. It's in pumps. Have as much as you need. Love it. Look at the fanciness. So fancy. Then the mirror to admire ourselves. Ding. <laughs> and uh, some body lotion here on the side. Nice little sink though. The hair dryer. There is a hair dryer. Hey, they include a plunger. Tuscany doesn't. No. <laughs> All right, so that is our room tour. All right, so if I had not mentioned prior to this, we're down here to test drive electric jet skis tomorrow in Tampa Bay. So since we have Hilton Grand's vacation and we had 1,024 points remaining for this year, it was either pay $120 to move those points to next year or pay $65 and stay here for three nights. So yeah, we decided to stay here. It was just smarter and better, so. Uh, it's 7.23, probably can't see that on the clock. We got here just before 7 p.m. So we're gonna go eat. Mm -hmm. I've been dying for one of those pizzas from McDonald's. I mean, they're the best pizzas in the world at the world's largest McDonald's here in Orlando. So uh, we'll show you some more of this hotel resort tomorrow. But uh, for now, we're gonna get ready and go grab dinner and then come back and relax before we drive to Tampa tomorrow to drive electric jet skis. Yeah. That video will be the following video to this one, by the way. So. Will it be? You wouldn't put it first? I no. guess you like I was going to try to do it in order. order. Yeah. The travel down, the resort, the jet skis. If we do anything Tuesday, the travel. But the resort kind of goes over multiple days. It does, but it's only of this place. So. That's true. Yeah. That's true. Okay. All right. We're going to go eat. Let's, uh, let's go eat. Yep. We're back at the world's largest McDonald's. It was a little bit of a nightmare, but worth it. <laughs> Building 11. A little bit of the look in the daytime. Oh yeah. So they have vending on uh, level one on every in every building except for building one and two. In building one and two, the vending and ice is on level three. Went to Coke, 12 ounce Coke. 89 cents. Or a dollar again. Hold on, I'm trying water. I can't tell. I think it's a dollar again. Cause they say a dollar 25. But the ice is great. We're gonna get us some ice, continue on our day. Go karts. They're a status symbol. We got a blue owner's wristbands. And look at this, a little picnic table area. Mm, Grilla. Grill out. Grills. Wow. That's cool. That's really cool. That's really nice. Is there? You can borrow them from the marketplace. They even have utensils and everything. That's pretty nice. We're trying to figure out how to get to the pool area. It might be this way. Let's let's give it a try. Left. Right. Right. Oh. Looks like they even have lights for nighttime. That looks like a swamp. Danger. And Alligators and snakes may be in the area. Stay away from water, do not feed the wildlife. That's good to know. I don't know what I'd do if I saw an alligator in person. I think it's pretty cool. Just glad to know to be on the lookout for snakes now. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right. This looks like pickleball here. All right. Shuffleboard. Yeah, yeah. I think you can rent like the uh, equipment, like you just go up to the counter and you're able to get it. They have cornhole and stuff as well. Lights and everything. Scorecard. This is pretty nice. What do you think, my queen? It's so crazy to be tall and be in a pool. <laughs> That's true. Luckily, since it's a Wednesday, there's no kids here, so I don't mind filming this. <laughs> Hopscotch, connect four, an entire playground, some spinny thing, and it's all shaded. Ah, there's pool. So, ping pong. Oh, we gotta go look over here. And then the pool's like right there. I can't believe they have pool tables out here. That's pretty cool. Are the balls in here? Yeah. Wow, amazing. There's the uh, ping pong paddles and stuff. And then through here, 
some seating and a nice view of this little lake. I don't see any alligators or snakes, but a very nice view. There's even a light in here for nighttime. This place is great. Here's into the pool. Looks like there's a hot tub too. Heck yeah. Let's go out there. This looks like it was a hot tub. We gotta get a photo here. It looks like a ring. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, we got a little fountain out there. Now, nah, hate I didn't bring my other phone. It takes better photos. And that's the uh, view behind us here. I didn't notice how all the tops of them look like that. Oh, wow. That's a really big turtle. <laughs> it is like an entryway. <laughs> very, very nice. I like the waterfall. Nobody's even in the pool. Wow. Even got the little bathing thing. There's a one foot pool. Wow. That's crazy. It's a good size. It's like one of those uh, kids' splash pads. There you go. For the like, toddlers. Quite amazing. A waterfall. Not a big pool. This is dope. Quite amazing. I think this might be better than Tuscany Village. Yeah. <laughs> towels, looks like they're out. Where you return towels. Bathrooms, men and women. And then uh, this goes to the activity center. And there's an elevator over here. Oh, there's a bar here. It ain't open yet. That's like closed off on the inside too. They do like art and different stuff in the activity centers. Oh, they have propane heaters when it gets cold. Nice. So that's team members only. Ooh. Oh. We got like everything in here. Beer, ice cream and stuff, food. Dope. Very, very, very nice. Oh, they even got liquor. Nice. You ain't gotta leave for nothing. You can come in here and buy everything you need. And to show the full 360, that's the lobby where we were when we checked in. So you can go straight from in the lobby, straight out to the pool. That's open 7 a.m. to 11 p.m. It's really nice. Yeah, let's find some towels. Three hot tubs, the one in the back, the one in the middle, and the one with the waterfall. It's like a stage. I must do something there. That's probably where trivia and karaoke is. They do all those kind of events. So you look gorgeous, my queen. Let's let's clickbait there. Look at that. Yeah. Hold on. Clickbait a bowl. That's so so nice. Now we get food. We thought it was cool. It moves. <laughs> That's great. Complimentary water. So here's a look at the uh, menu here. And drinks. And owners, we supposed to say 10%. I don't know if I actually did. Now that I think about it, but I was close to it. Oh, this is our food. Well, this is our lunch for today. Look at that. Okay. Got a nice burger. She got some delicious looking nachos. Those look so good, babe. <laughs> Let's pick out. The burger is delicious. These are delicious. Definitely worth eating here if you're staying here. 100% worth it. And this was $18, so it's not like it's much more than, you know, a normal meal in Orlando. Because mm -hmm. yours was what, like 15? Or 16, 15. 16, so 16, 18, 30 bucks for a meal. Can't beat it. Refills on the sodas, $4. I love it. Oh, that was so delicious. Satisfied? 
All right, now we're gonna enjoy this pool some more. That's nice, I didn't realize one was out here as well. Every hour the bell rings. That's really cool. <laughs> we uh, joined the bingo game. It was a $5 room charge to join, but uh, it looks pretty fun and we wanted to play bingo. Obviously, haha, very funny. I need all of your bingo time. All right, we won bingo. Let's let's see what we have here. We got a hat. We got a bubble popper thingy. Dang. And we got a Bluetooth speaker. Heck yeah. Oh, and uh, inflatable football. It almost looks like the uh, Apple one. And a bag that matches my outfit. This is in Orlando Vice from my queen. So good. Normal price, fourteen dollars. Goodness gracious. Good? You would like it. Like it. This is the middle hot tub. Jets everything. So very nice. Love the waterfall. Definitely my favorite. And this one, this hot tub has a waterfall. Like that's dope. So cool. Yeah. Yeah, the waterfall is even warm. <laughs> oh yeah. Under the waterfall. This is great. <laughs> Paradise is very nice. And this is the round hot tub. So we have a square one, a round one, and the one with the waterfall. Pretty dope. And then of course, more places to sit. I like how these are like divided. That's pretty cool. Yeah. Gotta get another towel. I want one of those rooms. That deck, that deck looks way cool. Water foam to refill your water bottles. Fitness center. Well, we got water, towels, stuff to clean with. Massage room. Got the ellipticals and the treadmill. Ooh, these have the screens on them. Very cool. Even got a Peloton. Heck yeah. Free weights, mirrors to admire yourself. It's not gym. Nope, nothing. Darn it. All right, well, this is the gym. I look a little better. <laughs> it smells really good. Nice drums. Whoa, look at this. There's the theater. Wow, that's what that is. Got a little TV and sitting area here. The DVD rental places, an ATM, really nice fireplace, and a whole piano. Yamaha. Wow. Very cool. Whoa, this is like the business center area. Four windows, desktop set up, and a printer. It's pretty dope. Nice and helpful. Oh, I like it. Very, very nice area though. This one's a Somerset house. Like Kentucky? I was about to say, like Kentucky. That's what's inside of those if you were curious. So the housekeeping rules, checkout is at 10 a.m. Business center information, building amenities, no lifeguard on duty, etc. Yeah, computer and Xbox games. On-site recreation, bill service, the bar, market, the owner's info. And then uh, this is a whole map of the complex. What is G? Fitness trail. Yeah, there is a trail that goes all the way around the lake. But uh, all these buildings and stuff is uh, how it's laid out. And there's a little bit more of a uh, more info from the map. So we almost didn't notice this, but this is the pool we already showed you. There's also a pool here. So our parish pool oasis or parish pool. Yeah. In the center is the pool, and I guess that's like a little oasis. We gotta go check that out. So this is uh, over to the other pool, the parish pool. They have the same little uh, grill and yeah, picnic area set up. Can't believe they have gas grills. That's awesome. Ooh. Ah, a lot quieter over here. Very nice though. Got a hot tub over there. Got ping pong over here. Very, very nice. 4.6 feet. Very nice. This place is uh, pretty magnificent. Definitely our number one, I believe. I was about to say that, yeah. I love the blue and like green oh, it color. Is, like thick. Yeah. Pillowed. It looks thick. Yeah. Very, very, very nice. Looks like there's something over here towels and an area that maybe is open sometimes during the day, but it's already closed now. It's mainly a three foot pool though. And we have these uh, nice security gates when you're exiting. All right, we're craving some Taco Bell. So we're going to go charge at the Wawa and get Taco Bell. Here for our last time, I believe. Professional. What do we got? One C. All 
right. We are charging. Good old Taco Bell. Oh, yes. All right, dinner is... I remember this being a problem. For some reason, Orlando does not have Dr. Pepper. This is quite a nice Taco Bell, though, I gotta say. Wow, that looks big. All right. What the... F that ain't not supposed to be. Spread my food out. Not completely made right, but... Still, still good? good? Yeah, still good. good. So yummy. So yummy. Taco Bell's our favorite. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Got all of our food eaten while we waited on the car to charge. After a nice Taco Bell dinner, we should be ready to go. Alright, let's try this again. There we go. Alright, this cost us $14.28. About $80 round trip so far. So it'll probably be about $110 by the time we drop home for 34 bucks. There is a 7-Eleven right across the street, which is great. And of course, fancy security stuff when entering. You gotta tap your room key. Okay, yeah, I got it. Then you get in. Bedtime. Goodbye. Very nice view of Orlando. It has been great at SeaWorld Hilton Grand's vacation. Of course, they're doing yard work, so I ain't out run out there. Hi, McLean. Hey, honey buns. So, how have you liked Hilton Grand's vacation, SeaWorld? It's my favorite place in Orlando so far. So far. I can't agree. I think there's maybe three or four other resorts here that are Hilton Grand's vacation that we'll have to check out. But so far, this one was definitely just the absolute best one. The pool was amazing. They actually gave us a discount for being owners. Only 10%, but hey, it's something. If you're if you're going to SeaWorld, I mean, you're literally across the street. You can just walk. Like, you don't need to pay for parking at SeaWorld. And, of course, everything is right around here. Chargers down the road, all kinds of food. At the end of the day, really, really great spot to stay. We are, uh, sadly, about to head back to Georgia, where it's currently, I think, 56 degrees? It was 53 when I looked. 30 minutes ago. 53 when she looked 30 minutes ago. I think it's a cool like 77 here. So I'm gonna miss this uh, this weather, but we're gonna get home, get these videos out to y'all. We got a Halloween party this weekend. Some, uh, some big things to look forward to. Thank you all for following us. Two big thumbs up to Hilton Grand's Vacation SeaWorld. Click like, click subscribe. Indulge in your life at indulgeclothing.com for the merch. We'll see you next time. Deuces. Bye.